With its advanced analytics features, the NL camera for partial discharge detection is the only solution on the market that offers highly automated problem solving. To start detecting partial discharges, first turn the camera on using the on-off button, or if you are using the bigger tracer battery, turn it on by plugging in the battery cable. Begin the inspection from one section of the substation, pointing the camera slowly at various components. To cover the whole substation and ensure you don't miss any partial discharges, we recommend that you conduct a systematic walkthrough of the area. Best results are achieved when the detection distance is about 5 to 10 meters. Although the NL camera can detect loud sound sources from a distance of up to 130 meters, we recommend using the multi-source mode first to get a general idea of the number and locations of partial discharges in a large area. You can then use the single source mode to inspect these partial discharges more closely and take snapshots for in-depth analysis in the NL cloud. When naming the snapshots, remember to follow a clear file naming system. Also, bear in mind that even if the NL camera might show multiple sound sources at the same time, it will only analyze the dominant sound source. When you find a partial discharge, it's beneficial to take several snapshots of it from different angles. This will make it easier to pinpoint the exact location of the problem as well as to analyze it. When you take a snapshot, remember to set the approximate distance to the sound source. This information is used in the severity assessment in the NL Cloud and ML Camera Viewer Pro. When you are finished with your inspection round, you can upload the snapshots you took to the NL Cloud. Do this by turning on Wi-Fi in the camera settings and the device will then upload the snapshots automatically. NL Acoustics. We turn sound into value.